Over the years, the local family has always turned to popcorn as a favorite snack at home. They've made their own and created new kinds. And now they can share their love of popcorn with others. The business they operate has sent popcorn to every state except two and even as far away as Japan. Tonight we take you inside the original popcorn house in Erie for our Giving You the Business Report, sponsored by the Erie Regional Chamber and Growth Partnership. A passion for popcorn. Popcorn with my coffee. I have popcorn with my um, soda in the afternoon. I'll have popcorn with red wine at night. Um, I've been known to. Now it's a poppin' business. Heidi Bemis opened the original popcorn house in 2019 in Erie's Colony Plaza after her family decided to make their love of popcorn something for all to enjoy. It was a no-brainer to decide what exactly we wanted to do because we have made and enjoyed popcorn all their upbringing and all their lives. Recipes were researched to create the caliber of product for customers. It's landed this menu, 25 to 30 flavors offered every day. Ken Kuchkowski is the operations manager, the popcorn maker. He's learned the art of making gourmet popcorn, starting with real ingredients. It's a matter of not just picking any type of ingredients, but the best ingredients out there. For instance, chocolate could be cheap anywhere, but we choose a Belgian chocolate, which gives you a much higher quality. No matter your taste, they're sweet, spicy, cheesy, even cereal-based popcorn. Each are gluten-free and some are vegan, but all can be packaged to your liking. We have done a lot of different events over the years um, and we can either accommodate the colors for the event or just provide our traditional delicious flavors. The original Popcorn House also works with other local businesses. Courtyard Winery in Northeast offers a wine and popcorn pairing. We incorporated it into our experience menu. We found that people wanted a little bit more than just your typical wine and cheese. And what's better than popcorn and wine? Aside from popcorn, there's other sweet treats on display and available too. All the popcorn made here gets sifted three times. So you don't bring home something like this. However, this is bagged. A lot of people come in, buy it for $1, maybe to give to animals and all the proceeds go to local charities. When you pop in, popcorn sundaes are also on the menu. A blend of ice cream and your favorite popcorn pick. It's a place for all ages to enjoy. And pictures of everyone who visit are proudly displayed in this locally owned franchise shop. It is a special <laughs> place, and there's only a handful of original popcorn house locations in the nation. The local family and the popcorn maker behind the one in Erie, they come up with their own flavors. Customer recommendations, though, or made-to-order flavors can be done, too. And there's even special St. Patrick's Day popcorn mm. that's planned for this holiday as well. I recommend the dark chocolate sea salt why? And the spicy buffalo. That's your favorite? Two very different ones, but they're delicious. How many did you sample? A Are couple. You, just a few? Yeah, they sent us back with some. Right. And you must have missed the house mix back in the newsroom. I missed it. It was probably all eaten up by the time you got <laughs> to it. <laughs> hey, I know that uh, you got to take a popcorn break for 530. Yeah.